Well, here we've got an uh, Oddball variety. This is an S200.19. These were some local uh, variations. This meter made by a local power company. Correctly remember that uh, the S216s had a problem with jamming registers sometimes. And some of these meters were converted with a different uh, decimal wheel. Whether this was a kit I'm not too sure, but um, the numbers will click over exactly per unit instead of per tin, like an insta consta mesh or a single mesh. So basically there is an extra Geneva between the decimal wheel and the unit wheel, while in the S216 there is a gear between the decimal wheel and the unit wheel. So yeah, we'll just wait, watch uh, it roll over. Test circuit 32 ampere and the voltage is about 230 to 240. And this is a dial test meter, a three phase um, meter fabric. Yes, yeah, you see the 9 is there and the decimal wheel just uh, rolls over to the unit wheel. Uh, 250 revs per kilowatt hour, so it's 25 revolutions for the dial to actually flick over. Have to count up a bit more, 37 ampere. Not oh, there you go, circuit breaker tripped. Shit. Reset. Oh, it's gone on thermal. Didn't let it cool down. Okay, I can reset it again. There we go. That's it on 30 ampere. And there we go. Shit, I just missed the roll over 1660. So I need to wait for another 10 units. Well, oh, there's an extra teller and a pilot light here. Just missed the roll over again, 1900. So keep an eye on it. Here we've got Larry's meter ticking away happily. A nice email meter. And uh, this is a bit of a metering video. And then, of course, the old NF Metro Viché. Here we're just about to have the rollover to 1910 on the Singamo S219. Here we have uh, just a quick peek on the top of the register. It's obviously, um, yeah, the decimal wheel is different uh, characteristics on this particular device. Well, it's still at 19, it's just about to roll over to 1950 kilowatt hour. Constant is 250 revs per kilowatt. Or, and uh, there we go. Getting close. This is an Insta mesh just set up instead of the flip dial. The current at the moment is uh, 29.3 ampere. And the number has advanced to 1950.0.
Oh, the load is going a bit lower now. Down to about 3 ampere. That load going back up to about 25. And we'll stop the camera here. We nearly got uh, well over to 2000 on the Singamo S219. So let's let the disc advance as it uh, goes. Um, this meter used to have in, uh, one of these flip registers, but uh, some of these used to go out of mesh. So this was a conversion made in the wide amount of electric power board days. A couple of these meters around, not many I think, but um, yeah, some of them were converted. So let's electrons. Oh, no, let's show it doesn't work well. We're just about at the wall of a moment, we 29.5 ampere load. Zero one nine 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 point nine. There we go. Twenty five more evolutions and it's all done. Analog meters are so much more interesting the mechanics. And there we go, zero two zero 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 decimal zero. Brilliant. Thanks for watching.